Hi Internet friends, it's Tim Schrock from Design Build Solutions bringing you today's Tech Tip Tuesday. It is on some new features in Layout in X14, uh, helping some elevations and sections quite a bit. So let's get started. Here I am in X14, I'm on a Windows 10 uh, computer and I've got an elevation set up here and I just noticed some new tools right down here when you select the elevation layout box there's three new tools here at the very end of my child toolbar uh, or edit toolbar at the bottom if you will uh, the first is pan scale layout box the second is recenter layout box contents and the last one is scale layout box contents to fit so um, I was playing around with this uh, layout file and noticed these tools. Let's see what they do. Pan scale layout box uh, pulls up a quick dialog box right here showing you the scale. 3 sixteenths equals a foot. You can still um, change the scale by clicking on this rescale layout view. 3 sixteenths equals a foot. A new tool also is if I were to open this, not double click on it, double click on it, double clicking on the box opens the camera view, but to open or uh, control E on your keyboard, command E if you're on a Mac, uh, goes here and I can uh, box scale is a new uh, panel in the layout box specification. So all three areas show 3 sixteenths equals 1 3 sixteenths inch equals 1 foot. I don't know what this means. Scale layout box contents only? We'll have to look into that one for an, another Tech Tip Tuesday video. Anyway, uh, pan scale. I can change the scale and notice my cursor turns to a hand so I can move it around now. Uh, remember how before, in order to move around, I'd have to shift the box and move it over and then slide the box. I don't have to do that anymore. I can pan that uh, uh, view around my layout box with this pan scale. Fantastic new tool there. Um, next is recenter the layout box contents. If I just click on that, it recenters the layout box content. Let's try this again. I recenter it. It. I'm not sure exactly what that does here, but let's let's over dramatize it. There we go. I'm going to have to understand that to a little bit better to really be able to use that one. A lot. And then I can fit scale the layout box contents to fit. So instead of a specified 3 sixteenths or quarter inch scale, I can scale to fit. Now notice that does all of the contents. Um, so terrain all the way out to this edge here, my uh, grade line, polyline, it did not go to the bottom of that. Interesting. So the scale doesn't exactly go to all of the contents because that polyline is is um, definitely different. But then I can go back. So it's saying one eighth inch scale. Three sixteenths. Let's go back to three sixteenths. And notice I see the new uh, predictive editing, if you will. And let's just click enter, and that will take it. Okay, so there we go. Some new tools in the editing uh, capabilities of sections and elevations in your layout pages uh, for new features in Chief Architect X14. I hope you've learned something new today. Uh, if you have, please leave an encouragement, drop a like, and subscribe if you haven't already. Click that notification bell so you get uh, notified each time that I drop a new video. I've been dropping some bonus videos once or twice a week as well as these Tech Tip Tuesday videos. But thanks along. Thanks for following along. Uh, leave comments too. I enjoy the interaction with you all. So have a great week. Take care.